And we're talking right now with Cassie Evers. And Cassie, uh, another one of the seniors on this team. What did this ball game mean for you tonight? We came out and we wanted to play so hard. We knew Carol has lost to him for the last 10 years, I think, and we knew that this could be our year. And we came out and we played hard and we wanted it. So I was just like proud of everyone working so, so hard out there. We talked with both Brittany and also Lexi about what it was like down low, but uh, you, you had a chance to guard Lexi quite a bit tonight. Talk about the defensive pressure that you guards were trying to put on, on their guards tonight. Well, we knew that Lexi had a good three inch as a good threat and so with Kirsten and so they were the two that we were focusing so we came out with some different looks at Fox and Mon and the triangle and it was just nice having the different defenses to switch it up on them so I think they couldn't get used to one thing. Did you feel like one worked better than the other? Um, not necessarily, just depending on the time of the game and who was hot. How, how much energy did you have to have tonight? Because Katie Tegas was kind of hounding you trying to bring the ball up tonight. Talk about what that's like, always having a defender there trying to you know keep the ball and, and find teammates and stuff. I love it. I love the ball handling aspect of it, and so it made it a little more fun for me, I guess. But um, my teammates get, did a great job of helping me out when I needed it and getting it. Struggled at the free throw line early, uh, yes. but you got some to fall late. Uh, how did you change that rhythm at the line? I just tried to block everything yeah, exactly. out. I came in with some bitters, and that's never good for free throws. So towards the end, I just blocked everything out and said, you know, three, just a shot in fact. It's not anything that has an effect on the game. When did you feel like you settled in tonight and this team settled in and started playing Tiger basketball? Um, the first quarter, we were definitely nervous, but I think we slowed down a bit in the second quarter, but definitely after halftime, so we bought, brought a real game. No points in the first half for you, but ended up the ball game with six. Uh, did you feel like the jumper was starting to come, or was it just getting some different looks and getting some layups? Yep, definitely. Just when it's there, take it. But um, I guess I have to pass more. That's <laughs> something that's probably bad. But I'm, I'm working on that, looking for those shots because I know I had to. Cassie, take us through that last play. Uh, they get it into Brittany, who hands it off to you. That means it's kind of on your shoulders to get the shot for somebody. What were you thinking and what were you wanting to do? Um, it's nerve-wracking, but I tried not to think about it. <laughs> I just thought, hey, you know, just any old play, we need a two at the most. Well, at the least. So, <laughs> um, we had the screen set up, and so I went through them. It didn't necessarily give me a layup, so I just looked for the reversal, and Brittany was there, so that's what I went for. How tough is this, though, to play so well but come up just a little bit short your senior year? It's very tough. We wanted to get comfy so bad, and it's, it's going to be tough leaving high school, never leaving them. But um, it's, it's a great start to the year. We came out and we played hard, and we're, we're looking so forward to the rest of our games after this one. Well, Cassie, I tell you what, great effort out of you tonight. Keep up the good work, and best of luck the rest of the way. Thank you. Cassie Evers with the Carroll.